Investigators in Shakopee are still looking for answers in Monday's killing of a woman who was found dead in her boyfriend's home. 31-year-old Sergey Belandin is the man arrested in the death of the 34-year-old woman. And it's not the first time he's been suspected of domestic assault. Bill Hudson is following up on the homicide and joins us now to explain. Hi, Bill. Hi, Amelia. Well, Sergey Belandin could be charged as soon as tomorrow with second-degree homicide. He's suspected of killing his live-in girlfriend in the home the couple shared. All of this unbeknownst to the victim's mother, who was downstairs. In this block of nicely maintained townhomes on Shakopee's south side, yellow police tape tells the story of a tragic crime. When a tipster called police saying a woman had been murdered, the trail led to the home of Sergei Nikolovich Bolandin. This is a, a very quiet neighborhood. Once police got to the home on Savannah Drive, the victim's mother said her daughter was upstairs sleeping. The bedroom door was locked. Melandon's girlfriend was dead inside. He apparently then fled on foot and was apprehended a few blocks away, hiding in bushes near the Hampton Inn. Neighbors say he was sometimes seen drinking on the front step, but Edward Nyakari never suspected Belandon as violent. No, I didn't have much about him. No, I didn't know much about him on issues of being violent. But it came out later that he, he had that, such kind of issues. Belandon and his girlfriend were both Ukrainian. Until recently, she worked at a nearby Dollar Tree. In 2014, Belandon was charged with domestic assault of another woman, later convicted of a lesser crime of disorderly conduct. Now, police who processed the crime scene tell me it was clearly a crime of rage, and yet another sad story of what is too often fatal consequence of domestic violence. Amelia? All right, Bill. Thank you. Mm -hmm.